Black Bob Park Pond in Olathe normally wouldn't attract much attention. Only one acre in size, it's just one of many small urban fisheries that provide recreation without fanfare. But this pond is notorious as the only Kansas water harboring a serious plant pest known as hydrilla. Last year, hydrilla was found by a Kansas Wildlife and Parks Fisheries biologist at Black Bob Pond. Immediately, city and state authorities, along with wildlife and parks, started an aggressive campaign to stop hydrilla from spreading. Since the pond was a headwater, it was certain that humans somehow introduced it. Jason Geckler, aquatic nuisance species coordinator for Kansas Wildlife and Parks, found red pea gravel from a fish aquarium in the pond shallows. It is not known if this is how hydrilla made its way to the pond, but illegal dumping of aquarium pets and plants is a vector for the spread of nuisance species. Always remember, do not dump your aquarium pets. It's not good for them, and it's not good for the environment. Never move fish between waters. Don't dump your bait. Don't move water between lakes. These few simple steps will make sure that you're not contributing to the problem of spreading aquatic nuisance species. And please remember to always clean, drain, and dry your equipment before you move between lakes. This doesn't only apply to boats, it's anyone that enjoys our aquatic resources. However hydrilla got started at this pond, the expensive eradication and monitoring program could last up to 10 years before the danger has passed. Worst case, it will escape downstream and infest other Kansas waters. So far, so good. This incident is a great reminder why all Kansans must help protect our resources. Learn how by visiting the Aquatic Nuisance Species page on the Kansas Wildlife and Parks website. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.